Hello, girl! Welcome to Watch Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 most brutal deaths in animated movies. Just happy that half the people on the planet are dead, eh? The humans earned their fate. For this list, we'll be looking at the darkest and most violent ways animated film characters met their end. Though we won't be including any anime films on this list, beware of major spoilers ahead. Which of these vicious deaths shocked you? Share with us in the comments below. Number 10. The Blender, The Brave Little Toaster the Brave Little Toaster is one of the most distressing animated movies of the 80s. Holy mother of Edison! What were you thinking? It follows five home appliances as they venture into the real world in search of their owner. Along the way, the group faces several dangerous threats. One of the film's most disturbing moments comes when the group ends up in a shop that sells appliance parts. A blender motor? Why, sure. I got a whole shipment of blender motors in last week. As the owner removes a blender motor for a buyer, the others watch in terror. The scene feels like something from a horror movie, from the clever shadow to the spine-tingling score. The fact that the blender can feel everything that's happening in this surgery is utterly disturbing. It still unnerves us all these years later. <laughs> you see? You never quite know what he's going to do. Number 9. Oogie Boogie – The Nightmare Before Christmas no one wants to mess with the Boogeyman, but it turns out the Boogeyman shouldn't have messed with Jack Skellington. And if you are shaking, there's something very wrong, cause this may be the last time you hear the Boogie song. Whoa. The literal sack full of bugs nearly drops Sally and Santa Claus into lava before Jack comes to the rescue. During the ensuing fight, one of Oogie's threads can be seen dangling. Oh no! Skellington takes advantage of this and reveals him in all his creepy, crawly glory. The sight of the skinless villain is appropriately gross, but it also spells his demise. As he crumbles, the bugs fall into the lava, screaming and melting. That's gotta be a painful way to go. Adding insult to injury, one of the critters almost gets away. Until Santa squishes it underneath his boot. Number 8. Clayton, Tarzan It's pretty easy to despise Tarzan's animal-hating Clayton. But I couldn't have you making a scene when we put your furry friend in their cages. But man, is his death disturbing. During the climax, as Tarzan fights Clayton in the trees, the hero gets the upper hand on the traitor and breaks his weapon. The villain isn't so easily dismayed and swings back wildly with a machete. Even though he's caught up in vines, he refuses to stop. Clayton! Clayton, don't! This leads to his literal downfall, choked by the long plant. The realization of what he's done as he falls and screams like a madman is almost as unnerving as his body's silhouette cast against a tree with a lightning strike. We see Disney villains die all the time, though not often by their own hand. <laughs> Family groups? <laughs> Excuse me, uh, but these are wild beasts. Number 7. Grigori Rasputin – Anastasia Don Bluth's films are full of dark moments, but it's hard to top this villain's demise in Anastasia. Dark shadow had descended upon the house of the Romanovs. His name was Rasputin. In this fictional tale based on a real-life legend, Anastasia is pursued by the evil sorcerer Rasputin. The latter gained his power by selling his soul to the devil, an act he eventually comes to regret. You are a beautiful young flower. Me, a rotting corpse. During their final confrontation, Anastasia breaks his reliquary, which is his source of magic. The demons that break free from it quickly turn on the antagonist. His skin and organs melt into a nasty pile of green goo while his skeleton turns to dust. Sure, he had it coming, but that doesn't make it any less gross. Oh, get me a comb. Find some cologne. I want to look my best. That might take some work, sir. That's not to it. Number 6. The Green Lantern Corps Justice League Dark Apocalypse War Once DC's animated movies began moving into rated R territory, we knew we'd get some gnarly deaths. Bloody hell. Now you've done it. Apocalypse War follows several DC super teams as they band together to try and stop Darkseid. Throughout the 90-minute runtime, a slew of characters meet their end, but it's the destruction of the Green Lantern Corps that made the heroic cause seem most hopeless. In the midst of demolishing the planet Oa, Darkseid easily takes down multiple lanterns. He pops Arcus Chumbuck's head with Omega Beams and snaps Kilowog's neck like it's a twig. The death that stings most, of course, is that of Jon Stewart. But those who worship evil's might and also teleport a portion of Earth's magma here, I'd like to make a point. Darkseid transports magma from Earth to Oa, 
burning Stuart away and destroying the planet's power battery in the process. Number 5. Slaughter in the Kitchen – Sausage Party This raunchy animated comedy explores a simple yet unnerving concept. What if our groceries were sentient? You and me, finally gonna be official. I'm so happy the gods put our packages together. It's because we belong together. It's like we were made for each other. And one scene in particular makes us feel bad every time we make a meal. Believing that people will transport them to a perfect great beyond, some grocery store items are horrified to uncover the truth. You're back, man! Crazy! Did you go to the great beyond? <laughs> Don't touch me, man! In quite possibly the most unsettling meal prep sequence of all time, a tomato is cut in half, baby carrots are eaten alive, and an uncorked bottle has its wine sprayed like blood across sausages. Bonus points for showcasing nachos is some sickening Frankenstein-like creation. There are a lot of shocking moments in Sausage Party, and this scene is chief among them. We got it red! Oh, we're all gonna die! Number 4. The Horned King, The Black Cauldron The Black Cauldron may be the most disturbing movie in Disney's animated catalog. Its evil power will course through my veins. It follows a band of heroes attempting to stop an evil emperor, the Horned King, from gaining a mystical cauldron that will help him take over the world. It reportedly underwent major edits after children and test audiences found it too scary. Yet somehow, one of its most brutal moments made the cut. You've interfered for the last time. During the climax, the Horned King has his plans foiled and is sucked into the cauldron he covets. First goes his cloak, then his skin, and then his bones are set on fire for good measure. We can't unhear his wailing. The Black Cauldron flopped at the box office, but this moment undoubtedly scarred kids who saw it. Oh no! Oh, horrible. Poor oh, sire. Number 3. Multiple Rabbits – Water Ship Down This adaptation of Richard Adams' revered novel has a reputation for being downright horrific in its depiction of character deaths. You only need to watch it once to immediately understand why. I know now. A terrible thing is coming. What do you mean? The movie follows a group of cute bunnies in search of a new home after one of them has an apocalyptic vision. Unfortunately, things are far from easy for them, and we see numerous highly upsetting scenes play out. Men came, filled in the burrows. Couldn't get out. That was a strange sound. The harsh journey is filled with violent and devastating deaths at the hand of hawks, hunting dogs, and even other rabbits. Though it may be animated, Watership Down confronts the viewer with the unfortunate reality of the food chain and environmental destruction. Can you run? I think not. Number 2. Quan Chi Mortal Kombat Legends – Scorpion's Revenge For some reason, we didn't get an R-rated Mortal Kombat movie until 2020, but at least it more than lived up to the franchise's reputation. Where is everyone, Papa? Hold tight, Satoshi. It followed a similar plot to the games. Earthrealm warriors competed in the titular tournament to save their home. But it also chronicled Scorpion's hunt for vengeance for the deaths of his loved ones. Come take it, like you did my family. Very well, but please. Put up more of a fight than your wife did. When he finds out that Quan Chi was responsible, their fight is absolutely vicious, with Scorpion getting insanely savage. He notably rips his rival's arms off, does his signature violent summoning move, and leaves him headless. My god will avenge me. Damn your god. It's devastatingly macabre and brutal, and it's everything we want from Mortal Kombat. Before we continue, be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. You have the option to be notified for occasional videos or all of them. If you're on your phone, make sure you go into your settings and switch on notifications. Number 1. Kenny McCormick – South Park – Bigger, Longer, and Uncut The 1999 South Park movie takes everything the show is known for and dials it up to 11. Times have changed! Our kids are getting worse! They won't obey their parents, they just want to fight and curse! That includes one of its longest running jokes. After being inspired by the latest Terrence and Phillip movie, Kenny tries to prove Cartman wrong about whether or not farts can be lit on fire. This, of course, leads to another brutal death for the perpetually dying child. He set ablaze as a truckload of salt dumped on him is ripped apart by incompetent surgeons and his heart replaced with a baked potato. Oh, and then it explodes out of his chest. Son, I have some bad news. We accidentally replaced your heart with a baked potato. You have about three seconds to live. That is one nasty way to go. But it's made even worse when Kenny thinks he'll get into heaven before plummeting straight to hell. Did you enjoy this video? Check out these other clips from WatchMojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.